Hi, this is Mike Giesbrecht with Prudential Sussex Realty. When you are going into multiple offers, and by that I mean a situation where more than one party is submitting an offer on a property that you like, you can offer the most money, the best terms, or even both. Money usually trumps everything else in these situations, but if you are unable or unwilling to go beyond a certain number, then make your terms as attractive as possible. Less is more here, so have less subject clauses on your contract if possible. If available, ask for all the documents, title search, property disclosure statement, meeting minutes, etc. before submitting your offer. If everything checks out, one less subject clause. If you are going to do an inspection, have it done beforehand. There is a risk here of losing your money if you happen to be unsuccessful in your bid, but sometimes it is worth the risk. Offer early closing dates. Sometimes having the fund sooner rather than later is very appealing to a seller. There are a number of other things you can do to increase your likelihood of success, and I would be happy to discuss those things with you another time. I would like to say too that even if you are unsuccessful, don't lose hope. You never know what is going to happen and buyers are often unable to follow through on their commitments. You may just get a second kick at the can. Good luck. This is Mike Giesbeck with Prudential Sussex Realty. If you'd like to make a comment on this video, please email me at mike at mikegiesbeck.com. Have a great day.